Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I know you guys are probably getting super sick of seeing babies on my channel, or maybe you're not. Maybe you enjoy the content. I'm hoping that's the case. I am back with another baby. This, of course, is Sam by Gundren Ligler, and it is the last Sam that will be coming out of my nursery um, for the foreseeable future. I do not foresee myself painting another Sam in quite some time. Um, this actually was supposed to be a custom, but I ended up not being able to do that. So I got to make this Sam for somebody out there that would like to adopt. So anyway, this is a girl Sam, opposed to the last Sam that I made, Strictly Boy. And I, I chose to do this just to make it so different from the other doll that I made. And she does have a magnetic bow, as seen right here. She's got painted red hair. I'm gonna it's painted red hair. I'm not sure you can really see it in the camera. I'm hoping that you can. It's you know kind of barely there. Um, she's got painted little baby fuzz on the side there. Uh, little baby blemishes and yeah the, she does not come with a belly plate but I really like to put the belly plate with my dolls just I just feel like it makes it a little bit more realistic let me show you the feet I really liked how the feet came out with the coloring and the mottling and stuff I'm going to go ahead and take her belly plate out here. here we go. And here are the little hands. The nails. I've been really, really focusing on my hand and feet detail work. And ears. Those are places that can get... Um, I don't know, a little bit monotonous, I guess. And I've been trying to focus my attention back on making them as realistic as possible and, and doing, you know, new techniques and stuff. So I swear to you, as soon as I start making a video, my cats appear and start crying. It happens all the time. So she will come home. I don't have the romper out here with me. Of course I don't, but it's the precious moments. Um romper that matches this pillow she will come home in that and she has a magnetic pacifier and she's really 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 sweet I love her I really do I'm so happy with how she turned out and I even did this like small little detail let me see if I can find it oh yeah that little like like I guess it started out as a um like a little cut but it just kind of looks like a maybe a mole or something but I just like that right between the toes. And then she does have a heel prick back here. You can see. Just very small. Very small. Yeah, and she also is weighted really realistically. I tried to make her a little bit more floppy. So when you pick her up, her head does tilt back like that. So let me show you the back of the head. It's the back of the head. <clears throat> really um took a long time painting this hair i'm really happy with it so yeah this is sam and sam, sam comes home with the artist coa and sculptor coa and the Precious Moments romper. She'll also come home in this little outfit here. It's just a little cute little knit romper that I got. Of course, her pacifier. A few other things for Easter if she's purchased before then. But yeah, I, I do like to add a few little small things in with the box opening, especially if it's a girl. You guys know I make headbands. So yeah, you will definitely get spoiled if you become this baby's new mom or dad. So if you are interested in adopting this baby, head on over to pumpkinsparklesbabies.com. As usual, the link is in the description. 
Also, people that were on my Patreon had a full 24 hours to purchase this doll before anybody else. So if you are interested in seeing all the projects that I'm working on, head on over to my Patreon. It's just $5 a month. You can cancel at any time and it really, really, really helps my business. So I will be working on Kirsten's um, little Walmart babies that she'll be sending out to me shortly. I will be reborning them and documenting the entire process over on Patreon. So don't worry, you haven't missed anything yet. I will probably begin posting videos of the process as early as April. So lots of stuff going on guys. I know that I have a lot of babies. It feels like for sale. I have a lot going on in my personal life in this next upcoming year. I will be posting a lot of dolls for sale. So if you've ever wished that I had more than one doll for sale at a time, these next couple months will be ideal for you. So I will be having a lot of dolls for sale. I have, I will be having a cuddle baby coming up soon and Manuela coming up soon. Um, and then I think Willa by Cassie Brace will be shipping out soon. So I will be having a lot of dolls that I'll be working on. And I do believe at some point in the summer, maybe early spring, I will be opening up custom spots for people that have um, purchased from me before and own my work. That's very important to me when painting custom dolls. I really want you to own my work and like my work. Um, and it will be 100% my artistry. You will get to choose the hair color and or eye color if it's an open eye doll, but everything else will be up to me. So once those custom spots are available, I will post about it on my website and or newsletter and or YouTube channel. So if you guys are interested in that, um, that should be coming up soon. Also, I will probably I will probably be able to paint a doll kit that you own. So if you wanted to send me the kit, I can paint that too. So there's lots of different like avenues and of course the price will reflect that. So um, that's something that's coming up in the future. And anyway, I will see you guys in my next video. I probably won't be posting again for a few days. But if you know anybody who is in the market for this gorgeous Sam or slash Samantha, please share this video with them. And um, let's hope that this baby finds a new mom or dad soon. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.